friends welcome back to my channel um today i have my regular it is the boxy charm base box i was trying to hold out and do all three at the same time but my premium hasn't even shipped yet so i want to get this up so i can show you what i got and hopefully you can compare it to what you've got or what you're getting or any of that good stuff so this is my base box um and let's just dig in and see what it is there's a peek and then here's our card it's bubbles and glitz and i got variation number 49. okay whatever all right so the first thing i'm going to pull out it is it is the Huda Beauty, and this is the Amethyst Obsessions eyeshadow palette. I was really hoping that I was not going to get this. Out of the three options that you could get, it was the Artist Couture palette, uh, Huda Ruby Obsessions, or the Huda um, Amethyst Obsessions, because I already have this one, and out of the three, this is the only one I already have. So I'm not going to swatch it. Um, I'll open it up, make sure it's okay. Um, it's very pretty, nice purples. I really actually do enjoy these um, Obsessions palettes. Some people don't like them, I do. Um, but we will set this guy aside and save it for someone else. Um, the retail value on that is $27. All right, so the next thing up here, it is the Glamnetic and it is the Baby Girl Lashes in Black Liquid um, Liner. Partly you do big protect. Thank you, buddy. Um, <laughs> this is what they look like. So they are the magnetic lashes. Um, now my dog did a big protect last night and I didn't even know it. And I just sat there and yelled at him about it. All right, so there are, there are eight magnets on there. See it very well. But eight magnets, and um, they're just kind of like I got the more natural um, looking lashes, and then this little um, box that they come in has um, has a magnet on it that they stick to, and then the liner it is it's a liquid magnetic liner. Now I've gotten some Ardell ones before, and it had a gel liner that you were supposed to be able to, they were horrible. They're absolutely horrible. Like it went on like tar, it was nasty. Um, but I will definitely give these a try. Um, I'm not big on wearing false lashes just cause I don't know. I've never really gotten used to it, but I'll give them a try and see how they work. So that, the retail value on that, hold on. Is $63. $63. So we're already at a $90 uh, retail value for just the, the Huda Beauty, Amethyst Obsessions, and then the Glam Nut Egg thing. Ooh. All right. Next thing on here, it is um, from Elemis. It is the um, Superfood Glow Priming Moisturizer. So reveal a soft lit from within glow with this illuminating prebiotic moisturizer. And they spelled moisturizer wrong. Um, the lightweight multi-use formula leaves skin hydrated while blurring the look of imperfections. It can also be used as a primer underneath makeup or applied as a highlighter to enhance skin's radiance. Okay. So this is gonna be like a luminous type product. Mm. Well, you know, I guess. Well, yeah, let's see what it's like. I was thinking I was gonna give this away when I saw that I had gotten a moisturizer, but if it's shimmery, no. Is, that's like a kind of a specific oh well it's not that bad so I put it on my hand and there's a little bit of a glow to it but nothing nothing obnoxious okay um, why why does this have to be on the box 
The directions on the box say apply every morning to cleanse to skin. If contact with eyes occurs, rinse thoroughly and do not do not eat. Okay, so the retail on this is $49. All right, cool. Next thing in the box, it is right here. It's the Viseart Seamless Eye Primer. Now, this seamless eye primer works with all eyeshadows to ensure crease-free and vibrant wear, and it's $24. Um, Elmas stuff has kind of a, a strong scent to it. Okay, so it's just a tube eye primer. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see here. It's clear. Okay, so it's just clear. All right. Okay. That's, that's, uh, did I say how much that was? $24. And the last item in the box, it is the original makeup eraser, and this is the sponge. So this is the first ever machine washable sponge, specifically formulated by the original makeup eraser, and it features the same unique wash tech technology to erase makeup out of your sponge simply by machine washing. Okay. What's going on, man? All right. Okay, so yeah, I saw this. I've seen other people open this. It's got a little pamphlet in case you don't know how to use a sponge. Come on. But it's got like, you know, like those downy balls they had. It's got a little, a little ball cage that you can put it in and um, wash it. And then it's got like a, a flat side to it and a round side. So I guess you can use it. I don't really, I don't bake. I'm 46 years old. I don't need any more texture on my face. I don't bake. So that's cute. All right. That is $18 retail value. So this box is $25 a month and um, every three months you can upgrade it to Lux. And um, Lux is more of a mix of beauty and lifestyle box. So um, that is an additional $24.99 and this is just the regular base. So it comes with five full size products. And let's add it up and see how much it was worth for us this month. So my base box is worth $181 this month. It's a pretty, pretty solid box. I'd have to say I am, I'm not disappointed with it. Is it the best box I've ever gotten? No. And I would probably be more excited if I had gotten one of the other palettes, just because I've already got that Amethyst Obsessions palette. There's nothing wrong with it. It's absolutely beautiful. Obviously I wanted it because I purchased it. Um, so yeah, thank you for joining me today. And um, hopefully you're getting ready for the holidays and you're pretty close to being ready. But um, let me know what you got inside of your boxy charm. If we're boxy twins, any of that good stuff. Um, other than that, have a great day and I look forward to seeing you again soon. Go do something nice for yourself and have a great day. Bye.